Hey, uh, what's poppin' everybody? This, uh, this Jack move, you know, the guru of giddy up, but you can also call me the, <coughs> the pony commissioner, and, uh, before I start today's video, I'd like to say that 26 years ago, uh, uh a galloping baby pony giddied up into the world. Now, of course, I'm talking about myself, the pony commissioner, because, uh, today my birthday, man, yeah. 26 years old today, feeling kind of old, but I, I take solace in the fact that I'm still high stepping on you, fuck niggas. Uh, I shouldn't have said that. That was rude. I'm sorry, y'all. Anyway, um, the PS Vita, the PS Vita, you know, the handheld is quote unquote dead. It ain't, it ain't got no games. Yada 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 yeah. That Vita. Um, uh, I was talking to one of my partners, man. I was talking to Dr. Trey. Y'all know who Dr. Trey is, and uh. I was mentioning to him how I had read an article and heard in a, a podcast, Colin Moriarty from IGN, how he kept mentioning that DeVita had a, a, a attach rate, by attach rate I mean the amount of games per user, it had an attach rate of around 14 games, and Trey thought this was asinine, he thought it was crazy, he thought I was lying, but this is the thing, I ended up, well, first of all, to, to show this is what I did. I took the time out and I actually downloaded every single Vita game I had and to take pictures. I was going to record footage of it, but it wasn't coming out right. But to take pictures to show people my my full Vita games that I own. And I had uh, mentioned on Facebook in a gaming group how I had more Vita games than I knew. And about four or five people left comments. And the person with the least amount of games on that whole conversation he had 40 40 full Vita games you see you feel what I'm saying it was people with a hundred hundred seventy five crazy shit like that but yeah the Vita the Vita ain't got no games but it's people with a hundred two hundred Vita games like come on dude and I, if you watch the screen right now I'm scrolling through the Vita titles I got now this is 10 games each picture you see is 10 games except for the last one I think is a uh, it's not quite 10 but this is 10 starting off now what I want you to do is, I want specifically 3DS owners, uh, Wii U owners, and Xbox One owners. Those three platforms. Uh, since the Vita, y'all love saying the Vita ain't got no games. What I want you to do is, show me equal or more games than I'm about to show y'all right now. Now, like I said, we got 10 on screen. Then you, you go past that, we got, we, got, we got another 10. That's another 10 games, so we up to 20, right? decent amount but then if you go again we got another 10 so we up to what 30 it's getting it's getting it's getting it's getting, deep, it's getting uh deep now okay then you, you go again we got another 10 so we at 40 now people now see i can pretty much guarantee that people on these uh newer consoles the wii u and xbox one i can guarantee y'all ain't got 40 games man i can pretty much bet my life on it I'll still be living tomorrow. But, uh, yeah, 40. But how about I add another 10 onto that? So we're up to 50 games that I own for the PlayStation Vita. Now, that's fucking crazy. But, but, but to top it off, I'm, I'm gonna throw, I'm gonna throw, I'm gonna throw five on there. So now we have 55 games that I currently own for my PlayStation Vita. Half of these I bought, half of these I got free on Plus. Now, if you're a member of PlayStation Plus, remember you get two free Vita games a month, two free PS4 games a month, and two free PS3 games a month. It's a great deal. But um, that's all I wanted to say, man. Quick video today. Just want to show y'all that I do, I do own 55 Vita games. So everybody that's saying I don't know if they should buy a Vita. Vita ain't worth the money. Vita ain't got no games. I just proved all y'all wrong. In, in, in a compact little, what, two, three minute video? God damn. I, I work wonders. But, uh, yeah. Do a jack move, man. I'm signing out. Peace.